Hi everybody, welcome to Yesenia Plan. So here we are again. We are going to talk about some items that I got in the dollar store. I think everything is from the dollar store and the markers were from Target. So I went out this weekend to get some things for back to school and I couldn't help myself and I went inside the dollar store to see if they had, you know, some items at a better price, right? And I actually found some really great calendars for 2021. I know it's still 2020, but I'm trying to look forward to 2021. I'm thinking of all the awesome things that are going to happen. I'm thinking that things are going to go back to normal. I am also hopeful that for 2021, I am back at my office and the things have calmed down that the pandemic hopefully is under control or that we have a vaccine so i'm going to show you some of the items that i got i haven't opened the calendars i looked at them but i haven't opened them yet so i'll open them with you the stickers that we have over there were actually gifted to me so we're also going to take a look at those this is the first item that i saw that i decided to purchase it's a very simple calendar. It's from January 2021 till December 2021. The layout, it's very simple. It has all of your dates. It has a section right here for notes. When we look forward, you're going to see that every month looks the same. And honestly, I'm perfectly fine with that. We are looking at February and you're able to see that it looks just like January. And that's perfectly fine with me because what I'm going to use this calendar for will be for my office and I will probably have important dates for any projects at work or anything like that. It also has some holidays, which is really helpful. Again, I really enjoy the notes section because every month there's something going on or a particular date that I have to remember or <laughs> event that happens. The note section is super helpful. I love the little flower design. This will be in my desk and I'm hoping that we are able to use it for January 2021. This is another calendar. So if you know me, I love calendars. Usually I buy two calendars every year, one for the office and one for personal use. Again, this calendar, oh my God, it has so much color super inspirational and it was only a dollar i had to get it i loved it i might consider later on probably thinking of um buying a couple and giving them as a gift for some friends because honestly they're very beautiful and i think that everybody could use a calendar we're starting january 2021 with a very interesting quote it says prove them wrong so i like the quality of this paper it's a little bit better definitely the colors and the quotes this was the main reason why i decided to purchase this one for personal use because i like having some motivational quotes in my office and eventually if you're thinking of a diy when you're done with the calendar or that month you could even reuse this and frame it or do something else with it. So I think that's really cool. Let's take a look at some other months and some of the art that it has. I obviously had to jump into June, which is my birthday month. In June 2021, I will be 25, which is crazy to think about that. I love the quote here. It says, you are worth it. My birthday lands on a Monday. Ah, I don't know how I feel about that, but I know how I feel about the calendar. I'm loving it. Let's take a look at December and then we're going to call it a day and take a look at the other items. The quote for December is very meaningful. It says, every moment matters. I completely agree. We have to make the best of every moment. Even now with everything happening, I am very thankful for everything that I have, for my family, for my health, for all of you that are listening. It's not so much about the material things, but it's about the people that we have around us. And that's a beautiful thing. We have to enjoy every moment. This was the final calendar that I bought for 2021. 
I usually don't like to put that many things in our fridge when it comes to magnets or things of that nature. However, nowadays with COVID, if necessary, Tony is the one that goes out to buy the groceries. So sometimes I have to write a list of items that we need and this would be really helpful for that. And it's also great to have a mini calendar you know, that we could look at just in case if we're in the kitchen or we're having a conversation and we need to refer to a date instead of having to look for a phone or getting our phone dirty, we could take a look at the mini calendar. So I think this is going to be really helpful. Let me show you the back. It does have the magnet, so you're able to put it in the fridge. I'm going to use it and put it there. Super excited to start using it. I really enjoy journaling and having different types of journals just in case if I need a journal. I tend to use my journals really, really fast because I like writing a lot. I like quotes. I like writing, period. <laughs> so I decided to get two little journals that I saw that I really liked because of the quotes. So this one says, like a boss. I thought that was adorable. It has a lined paper, so it's really nice. It also has the option that it allows you to tear the paper here really neatly, so I appreciate that. Overall, I really like this one. I might use it probably for next year because I really have a lot of journals already for the remaining of the year, so this one will probably be for next year or for my office. If I have to go to, to a meeting, I have this journal. The other journal that I decided to get was this one right here. You've got this. I really enjoy the quilt. The only difference is that this one obviously doesn't have the spiral, which means it takes up less space, and the quality of the paper is better. I think that having a couple of journals is always good, especially if you're a student, if you're on the go. I like to have different sizes for my journals. For example, this one is small. It doesn't have the spiral, so it takes up less space. If I'm on the go, I could also add this journal to the on-the-go folio. It fits perfectly. It's not too big. And I could probably even place it on the folio if needed. Overall, I think that both of the journals were really cute. I love them. And I can't wait to start using them as well, probably for next year. I think we have enough journals. I don't need any more journals. This was the last item that I purchased at the dollar store. I thought it was super cute. It was a sign and it says, do you believe in magic? But the super cool thing is not only does it have unicorns, which I'm obsessed with, but it also has the other animal that I love. It's a double sided sign and it says no problema. Like the llama, you get it? I died. I thought it was so cute and I'm definitely going to put this in my office. My friends know that I love stickers, so they actually gave me these stickers for my birthday. I haven't opened them yet, but I love the color and I'm going to start using them for back to school because they have deadline stickers, they have important stickers, don't forget, and other items that are going to be really important such as to-do dates. Thank you so much, a shout out to my friend that got me this, she's amazing. This was the last item that I bought. I bought this at Target, not at the Dollar Tree. I decided to buy the Expo Ultra Fine Tip because I'm going to use them for the Erin Condren desktop acrylic stand, which is going to allow me to write in the stand the to-do items that I have for that day. So it's going to be really helpful. I really like the fine tip. I'm also planning to get a board to put that on the wall in the office so I think these markers are definitely going to be very helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe, touch that notification bell so you're notified every single time I have a new video. This week we will have a little bit of more videos than the usual because I'm getting ready for back to school. So I'm super excited about that. I'm getting some items that I need and I'm also decorating my office and house to get ready for the fall. So if you're interested in all those type of videos, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell. See you next time, friends. Take care.